gitu. Good morning, I'm Robin Van Steinberg, and welcome to the show for Charlie Bean and Me. That's right, and I'm Kyle, and welcome to your day two announcements. Well, how about we get on to news, shall we? Imagine if for one week, all of our social media feeds were flooded with kinds, uplifting news stories, inspiring quotes, kind comments. For one week, everyone united to focus on the positive. That's the goal of Random Acts of Kindness Week. Hashtag RAK Week 2015. Essence and you rock would like to mark this by giving you the top five reasons to be kind this week. One reason a day for the whole week. Now, Monday was mixed, so let's give you two reasons today. First, kind people are happier. Kindness makes people happier. Don't, uh, but you don't necessarily need to change someone's life to be kind. Small acts are meaningful for the person who receives them. Paying someone a compliment is good. good, good. Holding the door open for someone or helping someone carry their books. Secondly, it is always something we can engage in anytime and anywhere. It is a choice and doesn't need to cost money. You may not realize this, but every single moment of your life, you have the choice to act with kindness. Stay tuned for more uh, of the top reasons to be kind. And remember to flood social media with kindness. Are you guys excited about Jazz Night? I know I am. So let's get some more information. In just a second. <laughs> Jazz Night is Thursday, February 19th. Um, it's about all these groups of different artists, well, I guess just us and a couple of other ensembles getting together and we're playing jazz to entertain. What? Uh, it's uh, a dinner as well. We're serving lasagna this year and there's a bit of a swing theme to it, so it's going to be a great night. So bring your dancing shoes. How much do tickets cost? $20 a pop. History Month, and we would like to highlight important black Canadians that have made a difference regarding equality. Mayan Francis, a black woman born in Nova Scotia, serves as chief executive officer of the Nova Scotia Human Rights Commission. Francis' efforts to bring about equality are being recognized by the Golden Jubilee Medal. Today, Lighthouse Youth Group will be welcoming back Pastor Caleb in room 126 at lunch. She has many stories to share about hurt, fear, loss, loneliness, but most importantly, how to still live with love, joy, and peace. To be a real friend and bring a real friend. And how about we ask our other friends, Liam, uh, about what's great with the weather. Thanks. To this morning it's minus 11, but will feel like minus 15 with sun and cloud. It will warm up to minus 7 and feel like minus 11. Tomorrow, and tomorrow morning will be around minus 16, but feel like minus 24 with sun and cloud. And will go up to minus 9 and feel like minus 16 with some scattered flurries. Today's picture of the day was sent in by Tammy Sharp LaRue. Very nice. Don't forget to tweet your weather pictures to at Laurier Live. That's all from me. Back to the calf. Thanks, Liam. This is a quick reminder that there will be a cake auction this Thursday. So count your pennies and nickels and get your class a tasty treat. Attention to all Sir Will Free Riders. The bus list is posted outside room 210. If you want to sit on the bus, you must hand in your form to room 210 today at lunch. Hey sports fan, badminton tryouts will begin Wednesday at 3 p.m. in the gym. This week is for senior players, grade 11 and 12. Junior badminton tryouts will be announced later. New players are always welcome. Well, it seems that we've run to say. I believe you're right. Goodbye, Sir Will. I love you. I don't. <laughs>